keeping the forearms vertical. We want to try to keep a 90 degree angle between hand, elbow and shoulder. And then from there, one hand at a time, we'll perform the wrist car. Pull the thumb, extend the fingers. One, two. Extend the wrist, invert the wrist, flex the wrist. This is where the forearm wants to turn in. We want to make sure and keep this nice and square. We want to evert the wrist. I'm quite weak in eversion. As you can see, there's a little movement there. Then flex, then invert. As we come from inversion, deflection, the hand wants to cup and close. It's very important that we keep the hand extended all the way through. So as we are coming up, the hand comes up nice and square. It doesn't flex in. Now after we've worked both directions with both wrists, we then want to try the same drill with the fist closed. Don't let the forearm turn all the movement. And that is our wrist car. This can also be done by placing a hand on the wrist and performing the exact same motions.